Palming up, the latest quantum news on Blue Furs. And later in this video, Yerpa. From, McDade, Quantum. Network. We are currently in our subscriber building phase, we need your help. Please take a moment to subscribe to the channel, just like Schrodinger's cat, so that we can continue to provide you with the latest news on quantum computing, thank you. Bluefurs offers a wide range of standard dilution refrigerator measurement systems with options including wiring and superconducting magnets. In addition, Bluefurs dilution refrigerator measurement systems can be customized to meet the requirements of each individual customer. They strive for transparent company structure allowing the customer to get in direct contact with scientists and engineers who design their system. Company history. In 2005 Rob Blog Gears, PhD Physics, Leiden University slash Helsinki University of Technology, was hired by the renowned Low Temperature Laboratory, LTL, at Helsinki University of Technology, now known as the Low Temperature Laboratory at Alta University, to move and upgrade all of their dilution refrigerator systems. One of the tasks was to construct a versatile, fully automated gas handling system capable of working in combination with all the different dilution refrigerator systems. At the same time Rob started to develop the first cryogen-free dilution refrigerator system for the LTL. In the summer of 2006 the newly developed gas handling system underwent first tests in combination with the first prototype of the cryogen-free dilution refrigerator system. It became immediately apparent how simple and easy it was to operate the fully automated cryogen-free, dry, dilution refrigerator system as compared to a conventional wet dilution refrigerator system. The great interest that followed lead to the business idea of commercializing these systems. Rob contacted study friend and cryogenic engineer Peter Vorselman, MSc Physics, Leiden University. Together they optimized the automated cryogen-free dilution refrigerator system for reliability, ease of use, and performance. Bluefurs quickly established itself as a market leader in the field of cryogen-free ultra-low temperature systems. The company is today known as Bluefurs Oi with over 200 employees it has an annual revenue of approximately 60 million euro. Bluefurs Founders Together Rob Blog Gears and Peter Vorselman have over 40 years of ultra-low temperature physics and engineering experience. Bluefurs is dedicated to build easy-to-operate one push-button cool-down cryogen-free dilution refrigerator measurement system suited to the needs of each particular customer. Their dedication and expertise will make sure that each final product is trouble-free with a guaranteed long lifetime. Coming up next. Yerpa. We will be back after this brief message. And now. The Intelligence Advanced Research Projects Activity, Yerpa, is an organization within the Office of the Director of National Intelligence responsible for leading research to overcome difficult challenges relevant to the United States intelligence community. Yerpa characterizes its mission as follows, to envision and lead high-risk, high payoff research that delivers innovative technology for future overwhelming intelligence advantage. Yerpa funds academic and industry research across a broad range of technical areas, including mathematics, computer science, physics, chemistry, biology, neuroscience, linguistics, political science, and cognitive psychology. Most Yerpa research is unclassified and openly published. Yerpa transfers successful research results and technologies to other government agencies. Notable Yerpa investments include quantum computing, superconducting computing, machine learning, and forecasting tournaments. Mission Yerpa characterizes its mission as follows. To envision and lead high-risk, high-payoff research that delivers innovative technology for future overwhelming intelligence advantage. History In 1958, the first Advanced Research Projects Agency, or ARPA, was created in response to an unanticipated surprise the Soviet Union's successful launch of Sputnik on October 4, 1957. The ARPA model was designed to anticipate and preempt technological surprise. Authorized by the ODNI in 2006, 
Yerpa was modeled after DARPA but focused on national intelligence needs, rather than military needs. The agency was a consolidation of the National Security Agency's Disruptive Technology Office, the National Geospatial Intelligence Agency's National Technology Alliance, and the Central Intelligence Agency's Intelligence Technology Innovation Center. Yerpa operations began on October 1, 2007 with Lisa Porter as founding director. Its headquarters, a new building in M Square, the University of Maryland's research park in Riverdale Park, Maryland, was dedicated in April 2009. Yerpa's quantum computing research was named Science Magazine's Breakthrough of the Year in 2010. In 2015, Yerpa was named to lead foundational research and development in the National Strategic Computing Initiative. Yerpa is also a part of other White House science and technology efforts, including the U.S. Brain Initiative, and the nanotechnology-inspired Grand Challenge for Future Computing. In 2013, New York Times op-ed columnist David Brooks called Yerpa one of the government's most creative agencies. Approach Yerpa invests in multi-year research programs, in which academic and industry teams compete to solve a well-defined set of technical problems, regularly scored on a shared set of metrics and milestones. Each program is led by an Yerpa program manager, PM, who is a term-limited government employee. Yerpa programs are meant to enable researchers to pursue ideas that are potentially disruptive to the status quo. Most Yerpa research is unclassified and openly published. Yerpa transfers successful research results and technologies to other government agencies. Research fields Yerpa is also involved in high-performance computing and alternative computing methods. In 2015, Yerpa was named as one of two foundational research and development agencies in the National Strategic Computing Initiative, with the specific charge of future computing paradigms offering an alternative to standard semiconductor computing technologies. Several programs at Yerpa focus on quantum computing and neuroscience. Yerpa is a major funder of quantum computing research due to its applications in quantum cryptography. Quantum computing research funded by Yerpa was named Science Magazine's Breakthrough of the Year in 2010, and physicist David Wineland was a winner of the 2012 Nobel Prize in Physics for quantum computing research funded by Yerpa. Yerpa is also involved in neuromorphic computation efforts as part of the U.S. Brain Initiative and the National Nanotechnology Initiative's Grand Challenge for Future Computing. Yerpa's MICRONS project seeks to reverse engineer one cubic millimeter of brain tissue and use insights from its study to improve machine learning and artificial intelligence. Support the channel with a 50, 25, or $5 donation, or any other amount you choose. Your donations are greatly appreciated and allows McDade Quantum Network to continue to produce great news and content on the major players in quantum computing.